yeah, I had a guy working back here. I don't know where he ran off to. Oh, there he goes. He's helping somebody now. Yeah, I can take care of you. What do you need? You guys got hit by the storm, too. Yeah, it got us. But our power didn't go out. <clears throat> you know, we got backup generators here in the store. Yeah. Do you have one? A generator. You got one running now. But what brand do you have? Hmm. Yeah, we sell those brands here. We got everything you need. Dealing with hardware and appliances. Hmm. Do you have all your uh, appliances hooked up to the generator? No. Everything's not hooked up. Hmm. Yeah, we got to take care of that. Did you take a picture of your generator? Can I see it? Yeah, you see this right here, this outlet. We have an extension cord that can fit this and this can hook up those appliances for you. Yeah, I can show you what I got. Let me see it again. Or I'll be back and see what I got. Some trees got knocked down in front of your house. Did it damage your house? In front of your driveway so you can't get out. Your friend brought you here. Okay, well, we have what you need to uh, get rid of those trees and get them cut down for you. Or we can go out there and remove the trees. Yeah, we charge for that. At $200. It depends on how big the trees are. They're a good size. Hmm, I see. Well, I can see what I have here. Like chainsaws and axes. Chainsaw. Or I'll get that extension cord. Give me a second. I think I got what you need. These are hard to come by. You yeah, bring up that picture again. I can show you. You're going to need this extension cord. This is going to fit inside, uh, inside of there. Yes. Yeah, that end will fit right in there. Mm-hmm. Great, because there's three on here. One, two, three. You hook up those right in here, and it'll get you going. This is fourteen ninety-five. You want to go with us? Or here you go. You just sit it there. Thanks for coming back here. This is where we keep all of our chainsaws and axes and stuff like that and i wanted to show you this particular model it's model cs 1500 it's from a company called oregon as you can see here it's a great chainsaw it's one of our best sellers so you said you wanted an electric chainsaw instead of the gas is that correct okay well here you will be able to hook up your extension cord to this connection here yeah you'll plug it right in there and then you can hook your extension cord directly to your generator 
That's right. It'll go right into that connection, into that plug. And as you can see, the chain is exposed so our customers can see exactly what they're purchasing. So that's how the chain looks. But it's going to come with this protector that you want to keep on there at all times when you're not using this device. And this here will protect the chain when it's not in use, okay? So, um, this here, this is $79.95. How much are you willing to spend on a chainsaw? Oh, okay. I can briefly go over a few things on this chainsaw. Now, what you have here is a tensioning dial right here. And this will help uh, loosen and tighten the chain. What you want to do is you want to loosen the black dial in the center. And then you can turn this to either loosen the chain like so, or you can tighten it up. Yeah, you don't want it too tight or too loose, I would say. And then you just turn the black dial and tighten it where you want the chain to be at before you start cutting those trees. But you always want to make sure that you read these uh, instructions. It's going to come with an instruction manual like this. Mm -hmm. And then it'll show you exactly how to use this device. And it'll give you personal safety tips. So you want to be careful when you use this, okay? Mm -hmm. Now, when you use this chainsaw, there's a handle up here that you want to grab. You want to make sure your thumb is underneath the handle like this. And then with your right hand, this is where you will grab and operate the chainsaw with this trigger. Mm -hmm. This lever here is a sharpening lever right here. This will help sharpen the chain when it starts getting dull and you're unable to cut the trees fast enough. You can use this to sharpen that chain. So you want to operate it at normal speed and you'll use this to help sharpen that chain. This here is where you'll keep your oil in, in this reservoir. This is very important because this is where you want to put your oil in right here and it'll keep the, the chain lubricated. Yeah, you want to make sure you, you see your oil in this, uh, in this reservoir. You'll see it through here when you start pouring the oil in. I'll get you a bottle of oil. As a matter of fact, let me get that now for you. Okay, I'll be back. Yeah, just look around the store. Okay. I can include this oil, this uh, bar and chain oil for your chainsaw. If you were to get this today, I'll include this with your purchase. And you'll fill this up like so. Well, this is for $5.95, but I'll give it to you if you were to get this today. And we also sell the replacement chains here too. 
so if your chain starts to get dull and worn out you can come here and get a replacement for it I'll show you how that looks yeah resell those Placement chains. Did you want to get one of these today so you'll have it? Or do you want to wait? It's up to you. Okay. Just let me know. And if you have any problems using this chainsaw at all, don't hesitate to call me. Mm. Yeah, just call me at any time. Or you want to get this today. All right. This is $4.95. Yeah, $4.95. That's it. I'll have one of the guys get you one of these in the back. Yeah, we have a few of these in stock. Does your friend know how to operate a chainsaw that drove you here? Oh, he does. Oh, great. You never know. He might want to help you. Yeah, that would definitely work out. Do you know exactly how many trees fell in front of your driveway? Oh, I see. Five of them. Wow. Yeah, we got hit hard by that storm. Yeah, it might return this way. We don't know yet. But you can always come up here if it gets too bad in that area. And you can stay here in the store. If you had to. Um, so... Did I answer any questions that you have about this particular chainsaw? You don't want to run this chainsaw for too long because you have those other appliances that you need to operate in your house. But you should have enough power. You should have enough to operate this, get those trees out the way and run those appliances for a day or two. That's correct. Now, I'll also get you a, a face shield. Then you can use that when you operate this chainsaw. Yeah, it'll be better than safety glasses because it'll cover your entire face. Now, do you have any uh, ear protection? You do have some. Okay, make sure you wear it when you operate this because these chainsaws, they can get loud. Right. All right, I'll see you back at the desk. All right, I'll get the face mask and show you. And you can use that. All right. Adjustment back here. Yeah, this fits uh, everybody because there's an adjustment. So. flashlight what batteries does it take in triple a we have those two do you need a lot of them here you go energizers will these work for you this is 24 pack 
it should be enough. And you can use this um, if your power goes out on your generator. Do you have it hooked up to your lights? Okay. So you can just use that flashlight and these batteries will hold you over. Let's see, you want to go with these? Okay. These are four ninety five. How many of these do you need? Just the one pack. Okay. Oh, I apologize. Here you go. Well, you came right on time. I'm glad you didn't. You're thinking of having a barbecue. When this is over with, I don't blame you. Well, we sell those here too. The barbecue pits. Mm -hmm. We got those here. Do you need one? The different sizes. We have a small one for you if you need that. Okay, I can grab one to show you. And we have the charcoal. Kingsford. You want a bag of that? All right, coming right up. This should be right up your alley. It's very portable. Barbecue pit. Yeah, you should be able to cook that in here. But no problem. this this will hold you over you need the lighter fluid yeah we got a bottle of that i can get it for you this here 9.95 is there any particular brand of uh, lighter fluid you need it doesn't matter as long as it works come right up i got you mm, did you take care of them Okay, when I get done with this customer, I'll go over there. Mm -hmm. This is four ninety five. Yeah, this will get you going. Yeah, lighter fluid. You just need one bottle. Yeah, this will, this will work for now. Now, is there anything else? Whatever you need. Yeah, if it takes all day, we just have to do that. Mm -hmm. Okay, you got to change your oil on your car. Do you have the tools for that? Ah, uh, yeah, you're going to need a, a wrench to get that off. Yeah, we have some ratchets. I can show you what I got. What I like about this is that you can move the head of it, see, in different directions. So it'll get those tight spots that you need to get into. $9.95. Since you said you've been searching around, if you run across any competitor of ours um, 
you let us know what they are uh, charging, and we'll beat their price, guaranteed. Well, within a 50 mile radius of this store, at least. Yeah. Mm. So you want to go with this? Okay. You know what? For all of your trouble, I'll give you this for free. Does that sound good? Great. Yeah, hold on to it. Got your MasterCard. your ladder for it. Chainsaw, $79.95. Can't be charcoal. That's right. I think that's it. Yeah, just give it a moment. It's processing. There we go. Okay, here's your card. So your friend here will help you with this. Great. Yeah, I, I hope you guys still bring it to the car. Well, it's a pleasure uh, doing business with you. And like I said, just call up here and ask for me, the tool supply guy. And I help you with anything you need.